this week's bouquet was really quite intentional because I wanted it to be more than just a bouquet. I wanted it to create this feeling of summer that you were gonna go ahead and take that flower, flower arrangement with you and just take it with you on the beach or for a picnic or even for outdoor entertaining because family and friends are starting to gather again. And I just wanted that fabric to be part of the whole event, whether it was going to be used as a tea towel used to wrap your lunch in or even lay the fabric down as part of the table setting for your beautiful outdoor event. So showing off two pieces at the same time is this desk area right here and then also this dress that I featured on my Insta stories and also on Facebook uh, just a couple of weeks ago. It is one of my favorites already. It has a nice neutral motif and you know I love anything with a floral print and anything that comes with pockets. So. Um, it is a very light cotton blend fabric. It has a really cute ruffle detail and it's a pretty everyday dress that's really comfy. It has a cute little tie and I really love the neckline as well. This is a cute little area that I set up this week and I just needed, I mean, I've had this bistro set for a while, a couple of years now, uh, but I really like the fact that I can just stay by the brightest window in the house and then just, you know, have some time to myself in the morning to just, you know, look at the sunshine brainstorm some ideas of what I want to do for the summer and so uh, this has really been working out really cute and I also have the other chair right over here this area right here I'm trying to make some updates there was a woven rug that I'm sure you've seen in photos and in other videos but I took that out and it looks really nice in the kitchen uh, so I just want to add something else here but I usually try and switch it up sometimes um, sometimes I'll just do a little cute doormat uh, but we'll see I'm, I plan to take a trip to Ikea and um, if not I'll just do the same kind of rug and maybe just add on a painted border this little area right here is just where I always like to set a cute little vignette because uh, there's this little frame right here. I really like the black frame with the gilded um, inner border there. It just has sort of that vintage look, even though it's not. Um, and then um, with this uh, piece, it was an antiqued piece that I just had painted in Navajo white by Benjamin Moore. Um, and then a garden stool that, um, I've had for years this is actually a candle holder uh, for the outdoors, but I like using it as a vase. So it clearly needs some new florals. So I'll be um, freshening that up.
So a little bit about this dress. This is uh, one that I just picked up, I wanna say a few weeks ago, but this is only my second time wearing it, but I really do love it a lot. And I'm not really a um, blue sort of person, but I've really embraced the color a lot over the past couple of months. And especially with navy, which is one of my favorite colors, along with this powdery blue, I think it's just perfect for summer and um, I think it would work really nicely with any woven. So I didn't take this with me. I just think it looks really cute and um, I have paired it with some Target slides, but it's just a comfy dress and I don't even think it costs much, but I do love it a lot and um, it's very lightweight and perfect for the season. So I think I'm all done today. I just filled up the little spots in the living room and in the entryway with uh, flowers, not even with the greenery, but just with flowers themselves, just to be nice and simple. Can't wait to show you other things that are happening here. I'm trying to transition um, this space that used to be the living room. It is now going to be my design center, uh, my little shop also for home decor and then, um, also for workshops, hopefully, that I should start um, up in July or August. So I will talk to you again soon. See you in my next video.